Hey girls, it's time for another stretching video. Um, I think I told you last week, but we're gonna be doing some overstretching together today. Okay, uh, it's nice and warm outside, so I'm doing it in my garage, but feel free to do it wherever you're comfortable. Um, I'm hoping that you guys have some panel mats, okay? If you don't, then you're gonna need to get creative for me. So I'm using my black squishy mat back behind me, and then I'm actually putting my foot up on top of a packaged tent. Okay, so you guys can stack some pillows, you can try and find some boxes, you can even just use your couch, okay? But find something to get that foot raised up on and get you over stretching, okay? So everything that I'm gonna be showing you today, I'm gonna do on my left side, because that's my good side, but I obviously want you to repeat this on your right side as well. Um, we'll go through a couple middle split uh, stretches to do together, and then a little bit of pike and bridge as well. Okay, taking advantage of that higher surface. So, let's get started. All right, so we're gonna start it nice and simple, just your regular overstretching split, okay? So leg up on top of that surface in front of you. Let's get into our nice squared up split, okay? Let's make sure our back leg is under, hips are square, arms are back behind our hips here, chest up nice and tall, okay? You guys are gonna go ahead and hold this for two minutes for me. So start a, a timer on your watch. You can ask your parents to keep track of the time for you, but I want two full minutes on this. Okay, once we're done with that, I want hands on top of your head. You're gonna hit that for 45 seconds. So those of you that are not all the way down, if you keep dropping your arms, get them right back up. Okay, we're trying to make sure that we're keeping ourselves nice and flexible for these leaps and jumps we're doing. Uh, after 45 seconds of arms up, go ahead and drop again. We're gonna do 45 seconds reaching forwards, hands on the mat in front of us. Okay, head is down. Making sure that back leg is still under. Okay, reaching. So 45 seconds there. After that, you're gonna lean to the side and put your elbows down. Okay, so I'm gonna scoot over here a little bit. Elbows down and leaning over to the side. We've got 45 seconds in this position as well. Okay, and then you guys are gonna give me 20 hip rocks. So I'm going one, two, three, four, five, all the way to 20. Okay, once you're done with that, give me 45 seconds, arms up, nice high V. Okay, hips again, square forwards, pulling back. Then we're gonna drop, we're gonna release our head and arch our back as much as we can and you've got 45 seconds there as well, okay? So after that, go ahead and repeat it on your other side. So you guys would start with your right and then do your left. Okay, then we're gonna go ahead and flip it around today. We're gonna be putting our back leg up on our surface. So when you do this, I don't want just your shin or your ankle. I want your whole knee up on top of that mat. Okay, and then you're getting into that split for me. So we're here. Get as far down as you can. Mine's not quite all the way down. Okay, sitting up nice and tall. So we've got one minute here. Then we're gonna go ahead and do 30 seconds. Hands above your head. Okay, try not to let yourself lean. You see how my body's wanting to lean sideways? That means I'm not keeping my hips square. Keep your hips square and then get those hands up. Okay, so you've got 30 seconds there. And we're gonna do 30 seconds with our hands on the mat behind us. That one's a little tricky for Coach Laura, okay? But make sure you're trying to get both those hands up on top of that mat. If you're having trouble, you can also ask mom, dad, brother to help you with that arm behind you, just getting it on top of the mat for you, making sure it doesn't slide off. Okay, you may need a little bit of help there, ladies. Okay, so do that on your right side and then switch and do it on your left, okay? Now we're gonna hit a little bit of middle split work here. So we're actually gonna start with right leg up, 
left leg's going to be out to the side. We're going to start with it bent instead of it straight. Okay? My middle splits are not all the way down, so I'm going to show you guys how you're going to go about that if you're not all the way down. And then I'll tell you how you should be uh, putting your arms if your chest is on the ground. Okay? So, right leg up on the mat. My left leg is out to the side. I'm going to get down as far as I can. If I'm not all the way down, I'm putting my elbows down on the mat in front of me. Now that does not mean that I'm holding myself up like this. You should still be letting that split go down as far as possible, okay? If your chest is down on the ground, then I want your arms out to the side, okay? You're just laying flat. So we're gonna hold this for one minute, and then we're gonna go ahead and put our left leg straight out to the side, okay? Same thing with the arms here. Elbows down if you're not all the way down in your split. And then if the chest is down, arms should be out to the side. Okay? And you've got one minute there. Then you guys are going to give me 20 bounces. One, two, three, four, five, six. All the way to 20. Okay? So you'll do that with right leg up first. And then you'll switch and do it with your left leg. Okay, so um, like I said, we're going to add in a little bit of pike and bridge stuff as well. So get your mat where you need it to be. We're going to start with our feet up on top, toes nice and pointed, okay? Legs are tight. My hands are going to be flat on the mat in front of me, and I'm just going to go down as far as I can here. Okay, head down and reaching, making sure I'm not bending those knees nice and straight. If you're having trouble with that, family member can push those legs down for you. Okay, so 30 seconds here. Then you're going to flex your feet. Same thing, okay? This one's going to be a little harder in filling in those hamstrings. So if you're on your fingertips, that's okay. Just do not let those legs bend. Another 30 seconds with your feet flexed. Now we're going to drop them down. We're going to press them up against whatever surface we're using, okay? So my feet are technically still flexed while I'm doing this. Flat up against it, reaching as far as I can again. Okay, so 30 seconds there. I'm not gonna demonstrate my bridge because it's not so good, but I got want you guys to put your feet up on top of your mat, okay? Get into that nice tops bridge that we work all the time. Shoulders open, chin on your chest, Hands should be in a nice diamond shape, legs together. Hold a good 30 seconds there, come down, roll it out. So feet are on the mat, hands are on the floor, okay? Then get up into that position again and give me 10 TikToks. In those TikToks, I want nice straight legs. I don't want bent legs, okay? Nice and straight, back and forth, okay? So 10 of those and then rock and roll it out again, all right? So have fun with that, ladies. Hope it goes well. See you soon.